I'm going to be showing you how to get and how to use the best macro for grow a garden. So this is the macro what you can use to buy seeds, buy gears, buy eggs and even cosmetics, whilst being AFK. So if you want to buy specific seeds and grow a garden, specific gears, specific eggs, you can do that whilst being AFK by getting this macro. I'm going to be showing you how to get this macro how to set it up right now so let's get stuck right in first of all you want to download auto hotkey auto hotkey is going to be completely safe just click download but make sure you are downloading version 1.1 you can download version 2 but download version 1.1 if you are downloading version 1.1 it will work if you download version 2 it will not work so download version 1.1 make sure you download in this one once you've downloaded that there's actually going to be a link in the description for this right here so once you download it and installed auto hotkey you then want to get the Virage macro, the link will be in the description. You want to right click on this and then you want to click extract. So you want to extract this, as soon as you extract it, you then want to go ahead and open it up, open that up and double click main. So I'm going to double click main right now as you can see. And because I did just double click main, this did open up. So now that we just opened this up, the, the macro, this is what you want to do. So first of all, go to your Roblox settings. You want to make sure that you've got UI navigation on. So there's actually going to be a setting which is called UI navigation. Make sure that it's turned on. So as soon as it's on, you want to go to settings, right? And you want to see what your navigation key is. So my navigation key is going to be the hashtag key because it does say use the hashtag key onto the UI navigation toggle in the Roblox setting. So you're just going to change that. Mine's going to be hashtag. If yours is a slash, you use slash. Mine's a hashtag, so I'm going to use that. And now what I'm going to do, guys, is this. So you want to do auto align, fast mode. No, you don't really need to put fast mode on. But as soon as you do that, guys, this is now what you can do. So just turn on auto align. Then you want to select all of the seeds. So I want to do all of the seeds just for the video. I want to do all of the gears and I want to do all of the eggs. So I want to get everything in the game. So as soon as I just, as soon as you do that, guys, this is what you want to do. So the seed setting will buy all of the seeds in the game, such as the carrot seed, the strawberry seed, the blueberry seed. The gears will buy all of the gears in the game, such as a favourite tool. I highly recommend you doing everything, guys, because you never know when you might need a strawberry seed or a cactus seed. So make sure you select everything, all of the gears, all of the eggs as well. Cosmetics, you don't really need to do that. But we've got the sense tab. All you need to do in the sense tab is turn on auto align, UI navigation. The donate is pretty much all of the people who are donating. If you want to donate, you can do that. It will support the game quite a lot. We also got the settings, which is going to be the settings. So make sure you follow Virage. It's actually the creator of a macro. But yeah, as soon as you guys do that, this is what we now can do. So it does say press F5 to start the macro and F7 to stop the macro. So I'm going to go full screen. I'm going to press F5. And now the macro is starting. So as you can see, the macro is currently doing it itself. All you need to do is press one button. And if you've got your UI navigation toggle set correctly, everything will be working. So as you can obviously see, it should, yeah. Okay, it's gone to carrots. It's buying all of the carrots. I'm not touching anything on my keyboard, as you can obviously see. And now it's going to go to the strawberry. It's going to buy strawberry. Is it going to buy stuff when it's not on stock? We'll soon see. Okay. So if something's not on stock, guys, we just completely skip it, as you can see. Like, this macro is so smart, guys. So, it's reading if something is in stock or not, and it's automatically buying it. Yeah, this might be the best macro I saw, guys. So, so far, this is currently working. It's going all the way through all of the seats, buying everything, and then it's going to teleport to... Oh, all right. Is it going to go to the... Okay, so what you want to do, guys, for this macro to work, which we completely forgot, is that you need a recall wrench in your hotbar. I've did... I'm sorry, guys. Let's start this macro again. So I'm just going to press F5. And you want to put your recall wrench in your hotbar. Number two on your hotbar. Make sure you do that. Because if you don't do that, you will not get teleported to the gear shop. So I did just get a recall wrench in my inventory. And now let's see if the macro does teleport me to the gear shop. So I'm currently doing the macro all, all again, guys. So let's see. 
So yeah, make sure you put, make sure you, if you are still watching this video, make sure you listen to her. Because if you do not put your recall wrench in your hotbar number two, this will not work. So I did just put my recall wrench there. So make sure you are buying recall wrenches because you might run out of them on the macro. So we are currently doing the macro and now it's going to teleport us to the gear shop, hopefully. So you want to make sure you have your recall wrench in your hotbar, specifically on number two. And you do not want to hold out your recall wrench. Just do this and it should teleport me to the gear shop now. Yep, but will it? Oh yeah, now it teleported me to the gear shop. And now it's going to buy from the gear shop. Hopefully. Is it going to buy from the gear shop? Yep. Okay. So now it's actually working. Now is it going to buy the watering cans? It should do. Yep. Alright, so it's now buying the watering cans, it's buying the trowel. Make sure you buy recall wrenches because that's going to be very important. Because every time you teleport to the gear shop, it will use recall wrenches. And you really don't want to be running out of them. Okay, I didn't really want to buy the favourite tool. But it is what it is, I guess. Um, is it going to buy eggs? Yes, it is. Yeah, it's going to buy the eggs as well, as you can see. Bought the common egg. Is it going to buy, yep, yeah, bought that egg as well. And it's going to buy, yeah, it bought all of the eggs in the game. And it's just going to repeat itself over and over and over again. So that's going to be the best macro. If the macro isn't working for you, that basically means that you didn't follow the video properly. You want to make sure that you put the recall wrench in the hotbar, specifically number two. If you don't do that, you can't buy from the gear shop and the egg shop. If the macro isn't working at all, you want to make sure that you set your UI navigation key, as I told you. If you don't do that, it still won't work for you. So you want to make sure that you set your UI navigation key in the settings, exactly how I told you. You want to make sure that you set your UI navigation key to the right key in the macro settings. As long as you've done all of that, the macro should be completely fine. And overnight, you will be buying thousands of seeds and eggs as well as gears which are going to be very very helpful for you on making progress and grow a garden so keep in mind you want to have a decent amount of money before you do this macro obviously but yeah that is how to do the macro and peace out